For this second part of the self-promotion and packaging one module, I have created a case study to group and explain all my personal branding from part one together. I have researched and written about new technologies, especially artificial intelligence and the place of designers in the future. I have reflected about my current branding and personal qualities that could make it better. And finally, I have planned, scripted, directed and edited a personal moving portrait to highlight my abilities as a designer and my design style and process. I have started by researching the work of David Hillman Curtis and brainstormed some ideas based on videos and articles about him. Having watched his videos, I had a clear idea of what I wanted mine to look like. Slow motion, softer camera movements, shots of my own work in process. I brainstorm ideas for each of the sections that the brief required, abilities, process and style. Based on that, I started thinking about what I wanted to show and what I wanted to tell, so I would have a clear idea for my script. The first idea that came to mind was to talk about the role as a graphic designer and how it is misinterpreted in the society. After writing a first script that I really liked, I decided that it was too critical for this and it didn't really answer the brief. I wrote a second script, this time talking about my path of becoming a graphic designer after being a filmmaker. In the script, I included bits of my design process, which I have supported with visuals. I created a short list, since I prefer to have it all as a to-do list, but also created some storyboard tiles to make sure that my ideas were clear. My partner helped me with most of the filming, since I couldn't film myself, and I directed the shots to make sure they had movement and were dynamic. We filmed for a few days in different locations, our home, a park, the city center, and a shopping mall. I started the edit from the first day of filming, so I had a better idea of what clips we would film next. I did the whole edit on Adobe Premiere, slowed down all the clips and added the voice recording on a very cinematic track by Dexter Britain. I have also created a square version of 180 by 180 to share on my main social media platform, Instagram. Overall, I'm very satisfied with the final result and the feedback I'm getting.